world of dolls and welcome back thank you so much for stopping by I have here a quick little haul that I want to share with you guys I'm sure you have seen all the pictures that people are posting on Instagram and Facebook of these items here that they're finding at their Dollar Tree and I was finally able to get some and I wanted to share them with you guys so that you guys can start going in. Because, you know, I go in the Dollar Tree all the time, but I don't always go in the toy section. But and that might be you as well. So if you're going in and you're skipping that toy aisle, you might want to start checking it out. Because if you are a Barbie fan and you like Barbie accessories and items, hey, the Dollar Tree has got them. So, I checked for a while. Once I started seeing people post them on um, Instagram and Facebook, I started checking my Dollar Tree. They, my Dollar Tree didn't have them. My Dollar Tree just got them in, and um, I decided to um, take advantage of it. But I did have my um, Dolly sister, Miss Computer Wizard. She went out of town last weekend, and she went into a Dollar Tree in the area that she was in and she found me a few of the um she picked up me a few of the babies and a couple of the kitchen accessories but all of these items came from the Dollar Tree so let me show you what I got so here is the toy storyline if you guys watch my channel then you saw me do a review of these awesome items um, I got from my local Ollie's I was excited to get them for $1.99 because I thought that was an awesome price. And it was. But come on, a dollar is even better. This little tea here is one of my favorites with Woody and the um, Fork Spoon character. Really cool. And then I really love this one as well. Um, again, I did a review on these. This is the sh um, shirt and I love the colors in this and all of the characters on this little top. And then I picked up two of these. Um, no toys left behind. For some reason, I thought I did not have this. And I grabbed two of them. But, you know, for a dollar, it's no big deal. But then I realized that I did have this. Because I found the whole set at Ollie's. But I really like them. They're really adorable. And then I picked up another one here with Buzz Lightyear. One dollar. Alright, so that is the Toy Story items. And then if you love skirts in all shapes, sizes, and different colors, you are going to love these skirts. So these are the ones that my local um, Dollar Tree had. I really like that print, and I really like those colors. I really like that. And the skirt seems like it has lace there on the hem as well. And then this skirt here, I picked up two of them because I really like it. I really like this skirt. It's black with silver um, silver stars. I really like that. It's going to go good with some kind of top. Make a great outfit. And then here I bought two of these as well. This skirt looks like a denim skirt with the blue and white stripes and a ruffle there in front. Really, really nice items. I like them a lot. They're really, really cool. I would have gotten two of the leopard print here but they only had one so I got the last one of those okay 
Now, yes, you're going to say I've gone baby crazy. When these babies first came out, I could take them or leave them. I thought they were cute, but I thought it was kind of pricey to pay $250 and $299 for these little guys. But then I got on the bandwagon and I ended up hunting them all down because, you know, you had to have every one of them. They had ones with different hair, different eyes, and I did get the whole set. But I had to add more. And I like him. He's adorable. I think he's one of my favorites. One dollar. And I do have two of them. Um, one of them Miss Computer Wizard picked up for me. And then when I went into my local Dollar Tree, I grabbed another one. And then I have two of these. Well, this is not the same one. I have doubles. And yeah, here we go. The um, blonde head with blue eyes. These little babies are adorable. And for a dollar, you can't beat it. And then he has brown hair. He has brown hair, blue eyes. One dollar. So, you know. Alright, guys. And then these are some kitchen accessories. You've got, this is like a breakfast setup. You've got a pitcher and a glass. You've got a jar of honey. You've got a waffle shaped like a star. And an egg shaped like a heart, sunny side up. And then you've got the tray to place them on. And then this is a spa accessory kit. You know, and it's got everything in there to have a nice spa day to treat yourself. <laughs> and then this one, Miss Computer Wizard picked up for me. And this one here has a little pooch with the bowl and a bone and it looks like a collar and I'm not sure what the red thing is but isn't that just adorable for a dollar my local Dollar Tree had this too but I already had one you know and I didn't need any more pooches I got a bunch of pooches and then this here is another baking kitchen accessory set and I really like this one and I already have this one because I purchased this one last year I think it was last year when my local Walmart marked it down for a dollar and fifty, but I decided to grab another one because they were a dollar. I mean, look what you get. You get the mixer, you get the mixing bowl, you even get these adorable little um measuring spoons shaped like hearts. And then you've got that delicious looking strawberry um shortcake there. And then this one here is another baking set. You've got uh I want to say that could be an apple pie, maybe. And you've got a cylinder there. You've got a pot. And then you've got another cooking utensil there. And these items are really, really cool. Really cool. I like them. And you know what? I like them even better when they cost a dollar. And then I also picked up these chairs. You get two for a dollar at the Dollar Tree. They also have other available pieces, but my local um, Dollar Tree did not have them. I've seen a love seat and a sofa and a couple of other things, a toilet, but this was the only thing my local Dollar Tree had. And they're really nice, you know, they're plastic and real nice for two for a dollar. You get two for a dollar. And this is what the dolls look like seated, seated in the chair. And she is a maid to move, so of course, you know, you can bend her legs a little bit better. But even if her legs are straight out, you know, she still is seated really comfortably in the chair. You can spray paint them another color. You know, you talented, crafty people out there can cover them with um, fabric. You know, you can do all kinds of things with them. You don't have to leave them like that. And then I also decided to finally get this handsome guy here. Somebody told me on Instagram that I'm definitely getting the fellas, aren't I? And I am. I'm really um, deciding to allow my male, um, male guys, I'm trying to grow my collection, you know, especially when they're handsome. And, you know, I had seen this guy several times. I mean, he's not new. He's been out for a while. But every time I would decide to get him, my local Walmart would be out of him. And then finally, I was in my local Walmart yesterday, and they had restocked. So I decided to grab one. And then the first one I grabbed, 
his eyes were crossed. He was cross-eyed. So then that means I had to check each one. And he was the very last one on the hook. And he was quite a handsome one. So I decided to take him. He was like, take me home. And I really like him. He's just a basic kin. But he has a very handsome face. And that is the end of my little haul. But I wanted to share it with you guys because, you know, I know a lot of you guys like to know what's out there. And you don't have the time to go running around looking. So I do not mind sharing with you. So the next time you are in your local Dollar Tree or near a Dollar Tree, you might want to walk in there and check out the toy section. Because if you are a Barbie fan and you love collecting Barbie items, accessories, and whatnot, you're going to want to check them out. All right, guys. Thank you so much for stopping by. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to check me out on Instagram. I'm Ruby Red's World of Dolls there as well. Continue being awesome, fantastic, and fabulous. And I will see you in my next review. Every single day